According to the Caldwell Hospice Facebook page, the organization recently learned that local residents have again been approached for donations. In the Facebook post, CEO Kathy Swanson is quoted. She says, we feel it is our responsibility to let our community know that Caldwell Hospice has no affiliation with the Hospice Support Fund. Caldwell Hospice wants to ensure the community that we never sell or share our patients, families, or donors' names with anyone. She adds, we are absolutely certain that not one penny of these donations will be given to Caldwell Hospice or spent on actually caring for hospice patients in Caldwell or surrounding counties. A legal disclosure placed discreetly on their website states that contributions to the Hospice Support Fund are used as follows. 69.39% of fundraising, 10.22% on administration, 5.93% on program services, and 14.46% on public education in conjunction with fundraising appeals. Hospice Support Fund is associated with New Hope Foundation, which has been sued by the Hospice Foundation of America. New Hope reached a settlement agreement with the Hospice Foundation of America in March 2014, agreeing to stop the use of the name Hospice Fund of America and the abbreviation HFA. Since that time, they have solicited donations under the name Hospice Support Fund. Swanson says when you donate to Caldwell Hospice, 100% of your donations stay local and they allow the organization to provide services, supplies, education and patient care to our community. Caldwell Hospice and Palliative Care is a not-for-profit organization licensed by the state of North Carolina, certified by Medicare and accredited by the Accreditation Commission for Health Care. Reporting for WHKY-TV News, I'm Rob Eastwood. Back to you, Ralph.